I gotta show my breakfast. I'm eating macaroni and cheese. Kato's eating like beautiful, healthy, homemade granola. Meester, what'd you eat today? I had Uncrustables <laughs> and kelp. <laughs> Uncrustables and kelp. <laughs> Breakfast of two. Yes, wow, we are just, we've got all the food groups covered. All right, good morning. My friends are gone because they're going to go into town. I don't really have to go. We're only going 14 miles because they're going to have to find a hitch, get into town, do whatever they need to do. Cato couldn't find um, fuel yesterday, so she's going to have to get it in town today. <clears throat> I think it's like a five-mile hitch, so they should be fine. But I have to go to the bathroom this morning, and so I'm just sitting here. Oh, my God, my nails. It's so gross. Um, I should clean those. I have nothing better to do right now. I'm just... It's going to rain later today so that usually makes me really clean <laughs> so maybe I'll just wait for that to happen um but anyways I'm just waiting for the privy and so once it's open I will go and then I will be on my way 4.3 miles into the road um that gets into town and so they should be there within the next couple hours and then um about 10 more miles after that and it's pretty much all uphill like some steep some very gradual um and yeah we'll be up high tonight so chances are it'll be a little chilly and a little wet but I'm kind of excited for this weather craziness to happen again we've just been kind of bored with the heat it's, it is supposed to be hot today there's a heat index morning 95 to 100 heat index today but since we're getting up into like the high 3,000 feet we sh feet we shouldn't be too bad but keep you updated and we'll see you out on trail all right got trail magic <laughs> this morning is so perfect I was so hungry we we're just gonna have a big climb I'm like I look over and there's this big table, which I'll show you. It's all set up with food, deli sandwiches and fruit and Snickers bars and all oh, the watermelon was so good and water and Gatorade. I'm trying to find the trail, I will do it in a second. Um, yeah, amazing. So the, it was a couple who's from New York. Their daughter through hiked the trail, the AT last year. And it was so funny, she made this little thank you card when her trip was over and must have sent it to like hostels, just for like anybody who helped her along the way. And her trail name was Wendy's because she had never eaten Wendy's and she wore her hair in these like two braids, just like fair skinned. Um, somebody told her she looked like the Wendy's girl and she's like, I've never had Wendy's and they named her Wendy's. So she <laughs> figured out how to get a Baconator a couple day old Baconator brought up to Katahdin and her thank you, her picture on the front of her thank you card, it's just her taking her first bite of Wendy's at Katahdin, which is just so funny and so cute. Um, so we are gonna start a climb here. Uh, I'm just gonna plug in and get going. Pretty much climbing on and off for about 10 miles. We'll be above 3,700 feet though. Sounds like starting at five o'clock, we're gonna get, it's like 50% chance of rain, 5 p.m. and then it just goes up from there. So my goal is to just get to camp around five and we should be good to go. Bye. Yeah. Is that the potato salad? Yeah, yeah. There's plates right under the, under the Sorry. Plates under the All right, well, so hot. <laughs> I don't feel like dangerously dehydrated, but I do feel just like, ugh loopy a little bit i'm gonna pump sugar into me this is what hostess donuts look like and you leave them in your food pack too long and i'm also gonna eat a honey bun so good oh i hate my diet out here i think i've said that like 20 times but all i want are like fruits and vegetables over rice i guess i could probably buy some rice all right, here's Vermont today. 
I looked, I took a little peek at elevation gain today and it, even in the 14 miles that we're doing, we still had about 4,000 feet of elevation gain. So that is a lot for 14 miles. Um, and I think when we did our like kind of difficult 24 mile day, we had about like 55,000. Um, so, so yeah, Vermont is, I mean, it's just higher elevation. So we're just coming downhill. We have, we'll start to go uphill pretty soon. I think it's about a mile and a half of an uphill once we start doing that to get to the shelter. And no rain yet, still sunny, so we're happy. I'm gonna try to hang the tarp. This beautiful people. Kato, right before the rain came down, went out to put her food away. And now she hasn't come back and she's stuck in this. Hi, Kato. Oh, hi. Both of you left right when it was dry. Kato, can you do a favor and 